हेलो फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो आई शेल बी टेकिंग द कॉम्प्लेक्स नंबर्स द लोकस रिलेटेड प्रॉब्लम्स आई वुड रिक्वेस्ट यू टू वॉच द होल वीडियो एज मैनी ऑफ द कॉन्सेप्ट विल यू कवर्ड इन दिस वीडियो एंड मोर ओवर दिस वीडियो हैज़ यूज इज इन मैनी ऑफ द क्वेश्चन दैट यू मे गेट इन द कॉम्प्लेक्स नंबर्स सो माई मेन फोकस विल बी ऑन द लोकस रिलेटेड प्रॉब्लम्स बिफोर दैट आई वुड लाइक टू टेल यू वॉट इज आर्ग्यूमेंट सी इफ नथिंग इज मैंशन एंड आई हैव अ कॉम्प्लेक्स नंबर जेड इज इक्वल टू एक्स प्लस आयोटा वाई then its argument will be taken as tan theta is equal to y by x i am only taking the first quadrant because that will only be useful because nothing will be mentioned so if nothing is mentioned then the first quadrant is taken as the default one okay now conjugate if z is equal to x plus iota y then the conjugate is represented by z bar and z bar is equal to x minus iota y okay it's simple to derive that z dot z bar is equal to mod z square you are comfortable with this i know because it's one of the easiest topics uh, the conjugate z into z bar is equal to mod z square okay division of complex number if i have a plus iota b upon c plus iota d okay so i can write this as on solving you will get you must remember it if you can remember the long long lyrics of the songs etc then you should remember this thing also because it will be very useful in solving the problems so if this is the equation that i am getting so i can solve it as ac plus bd okay ac plus bd upon c square plus d square that will remain fixed okay then put a minus iota and solve as determinant okay so in determinant i'll say i shall solve as ad c a d minus b into c so a d minus b c upon c square plus d square a d minus b c as a determinant so remember this thing because we cannot derive it in every question and multiplication is very easy if x plus iota y is multiplied by x minus iota y then it will be x square x into x minus iota x into y plus iota x y सी माइनस आयोटा इंटू आयोटा माइनस आयोटा स्क्वेयर इंटू वाई स्क्वेयर सो इट विल माइनस आयोटा स्क्वेयर दैट विल बिकम प्लस वन एज आयोटा स्क्वेयर इज इक्वल टू माइनस वन सो विल गेट दिस विल गेट कैंसल सो एक्स स्क्वेयर प्लस वाई स्क्वेयर सो दिस इज जेड दिस इज जेड बार सो वॉट आई गेट जेड इंटू जेड बार इज इक्वल टू मॉट जेड स्क्वेयर इफ देर एनी डाउट्स इन दिस चैप्टर यू कैन डेफिनेटली आस्क मी इन द कमेंट सेक्शन it is one of the most important chapters so now let me begin uh, for which this video is made this is, these are the basic concepts that you will require uh, in the in the video so let me start so first of all you know what is the equation of a straight line in coordinate geometry i shall re relate the coordinate geometry to this so ax plus by plus c is equal to 0 this is in the coordinate geometry so let me do z is equal to x plus iota y okay and z bar is equal to x minus iota y we add both these equations so i get x is equal to z plus z bar by 2 okay not a difficult calculation and on subtracting both these equations i get y is equal to z minus z bar by 2 iota i have got the value of x and y take this and put it in this equation okay so put so a into z plus z bar by 2 plus b into z minus z bar by 2 iota plus c is equal to 0 solve further multiply by 2 on both sides so a into z plus z bar by 2 2 has gone plus b into z minus z bar by iota plus 2 c is equal to 0 okay see iota is there i multiply and divide by iota on the b side so iota divided by iota iota into iota will be minus 1 so a into z plus z bar minus b into z minus z bar into iota plus 2c is equal to 0 okay now write the z terms together so i take z this will be a minus b iota okay plus z bar a plus b iota 
okay plus 2c is equal to 0 now what i do see i take alpha some alpha as a complex number which is a plus b iota so the conjugate of this complex number will be a minus b iota okay so now let me put in this equation let me take 2c as another constant some constant k because 2c doesn't look good okay so now let me put here so it will become z into alpha bar plus z bar into alpha plus k is equal to 0 so this is the converted form of the straight line equation in the coordinate geometry to the complex numbers see it is very simple see it is very easy to get so we can derive very much things for it now let me derive uh, slope denoted by m slope in the real plane was see in the real plane the slope will be minus a by b so minus a by b okay now how to derive it let me tell you there's things you can derive i'll tell you how to derive the slope see alpha is equal to a plus iota b and alpha bar is equal to a minus iota b add both these equations i get a is equal to alpha plus alpha bar by 2 and on subtracting both these equations i get b is equal to alpha minus alpha bar by 2 iota see this is very simple thing that why i am not wasting the time for the calculation on it so now the slope put a and b here what i get slope is equal to minus of a a is alpha plus alpha bar by 2 b is alpha minus alpha bar by 2 iota okay 2 2 cancel iota goes up so the slope will be minus iota into alpha plus alpha bar by alpha minus alpha bar you can simply uh, simplify it if you want further but this can also get us the answer so there is no need of cramming just use the coordinate geometry to get into the complex plane it's as simple as that so now the next question that can be asked will be from the circles so let me derive it on a new page okay so if i have see in the complex plane the equation of the circle is given as z into z bar plus alpha into z bar plus alpha bar into z plus some constant k is equal to zero this is the equation of a circle in the complex plane i will tell you how to convert this into the uh, you can say the coordinate form or you can go reverse also to derive from the coordinate to get into the complex okay see z is x plus iota y z bar is equal to x minus iota y okay so i get so this is here now let's put here z into z bar is mod z square and alpha see what was alpha alpha was a plus iota b some complex number okay so a plus iota b what is z bar x minus iota y what is alpha bar a minus iota b into x plus iota y plus some constant k is equal to zero now let me simplify further mod z square solve it ax this is just normal algebraic multiplication ax minus a iota y plus iota bx c it will become plus 1 into by minus iota square so it will become plus 1 now simplify this one so ax plus a iota y minus b iota bx plus by plus k is equal to 0 now let me do further see this thing this thing gets cancelled this thing this thing gets cancelled what is mod z is equal to under root x square plus y square the modulus of this thing so mod z square will become x square plus y square please revise the basic concept before watching this so it will become 2ax plus 2by plus some constant k is equal to 0 so what is this this is the equation of a circle so if the question is asked find the locus of this thing then we can get this thing as the locus of a circle so i would always recommend to take z is equal to x plus iota y you can solve any question on it okay now one more example on the basic concepts that can be asked find locus of mod of z minus 1 upon 
mod of z minus 2 is equal to 1 I'll take 2 for example 2 if this question is asked then how to solve it okay always put z is equal to x plus iota y this is my recommendation to convert into it into the coordinate form the coordinate geometry form because that is more familiar to us than the coordinate uh, than the complex numbers because complex number actually don't exist so now putting this in this equation so I get x plus iota y mod of x plus iota y minus 1 upon mod of I x plus iota y minus 2 is equal to 2 now what this will be under root x minus 1 whole square plus y square upon under root x minus 2 whole square plus y square is equal to 2 see x minus 1 plus iota y this will become x minus 1 plus iota y upon j v is equal to 2 so this will this and this can be done to get this thing okay squaring both sides so x minus 1 whole square plus y square is equal to 4 into x minus 2 whole square plus y square on solving further you will get some equation which will be 3x square plus 3y square plus something of x plus something of y plus some constant k is equal to 0 see we will get the center from here we can get the center of the circle and on applying the formula r is equal to g square plus f square minus c we can get the radius of the circle so basically the question that can be asked will be this question will be given and they will be asking to find the radius of this uh, figure so it's very confusing to do here on the complex plane but on converting everything into the coordinate geometry we can always get the correct answer to simplify this thing so another question that can be asked it is the last part that I will be telling for this video if the question is asked as find locus if argument of for example z by 1 minus z is equal to pi by 4 so the first step will be to put z is equal to x plus iota y so I get argument of x plus iota y upon 1 minus x plus iota y now simplifying further so argument of x plus iota y 1 minus x minus iota y okay now this is a plus iota b upon c plus iota d so simplify this thing so I get on simplifying I get argument of this into this x into 1 minus x plus y into minus y upon something c square plus d square actually minus iota this into this so x into minus y plus sorry minus this into y into 1 minus x we have to solve like a determinant here upon something see we don't need the denominator because we are going to get the ratios this upon this because argument of a complex number is this thing only this upon this so it is pi by 4 so on solving further solving further we can get x into minus y minus y into 1 minus x whole minus upon x into 1 minus x plus y into minus y is equal to 1 see what is the actual meaning of argument means we have to take this thing upon this thing so I am not so I am not finding the denominator here because that thing will get cancelled on taking the ratios of y upon x y upon x means this thing upon this thing so that thing we have to equate to 1 the ratio of this and that will be the locus for this equation so if there are any doubts then you can definitely ask me in the comment section please practice on it and do the questions that I have done here once again and other books also which you are following okay thank you